एवरी वन दिस इज नरेंद्र एंड यू वॉचिंग टू माई चैनल बाय गुरु टूडे आई मोइंग टू टेल यू अबाउट द एडवांटेजेस एंड डिसएडवांटेजेस ऑफ अ सेक्शुअल रिप्रोडक्शन फर्स्ट लेट अस स्टडी अबाउट द एडवांटेजेस ऑफ अ सेक्शुअल रिप्रोडक्शन वन ऑफ द एडवांटेज ऑफ अ सेक्शुअल रिप्रोडक्शन इज नो रिक्वायरमेंट ऑफ मेट एज अ सेक्शुअल रिप्रोडक्शन इज यूनी पेरेंटल दैट मीन्स अ सिंगल पेरेंट कैन एबल टू प्रोड्यूस द ऑफ स्प्रिंग दैट टू विदाउट फॉर्मेशन ऑफ गैमिट्स Hence, asexual reproduction requires no mate. Another advantage of asexual reproduction is it involves a simple process of cell division, that is, mitosis. As there is no formation of the gametes, hence asexual reproduction becomes the simple process of reproduction. Another advantage of asexual reproduction is it is the quick mode of reproduction in the organisms. Since there is no gamete formation, there is no fertilization, there is no zygote formation, and there is no embryonic development, asexual reproduction becomes a quick mode of reproduction in the organisms. Another advantage is production of large number of offspring. As the asexual reproduction is uniparental and it is a quick mode of reproduction, a single parent can able to produce a large number of offspring in a less time. Another advantage of asexual reproduction is conservation of pure characters we know that the offsprings which are produced by the asexual reproductions are called as clones which are nothing but they are genetically identical to their parents as it involves the mitotic cell division in mitosis the chromosome carrying the genes for a particular characters are duplicated and distributed among the offsprings so hence offspring carry the same character as that of their parents hence it involves in the preservation and conservation of character generation after the generation so these are the advantages of asexual reproduction now let us study about the disadvantage of asexual reproduction one of the disadvantage of asexual reproduction is overcrowding since asexual reproduction is uniparental simple and quick mode of reproduction that ultimately results into the overcrowding of organisms Another disadvantage of asexual reproduction is no variations in the offsprings. Since offsprings which are produced by asexual reproductions are called clones, clones means the individuals which are morphologically and genetically identical to their parents. Here the offsprings are going to get the same character as that of their parents. Hence no new characters are introduced in the offsprings. Therefore no variations in the offsprings. Another disadvantage of asexual reproduction is low adaptability. since no variations are created or introduced into the offsprings the successive generation may show low adaptability to the changed environment therefore in near future there are high chances of becoming extinct the another disadvantage of asexual reproduction is it has no role in evolution in order to survive on this planet organism need to adapt with their environment in order to adapt they need to bring changes that means variations in their morphologically morphological and physiological characters variations are said to be the raw material for the evolution of organisms here the variations are absent in a sexually reproducing organism therefore a sexual reproduction has no role in evolution so these are the advantages and disadvantages of a sexual reproduction hope you found this video useful if so hit the like button and also share this video with your friends family and colleagues and if you are new to my channel hit the subscribe button and don't forget to press the bell icon i will see you in my next video till then take care